Sick. Dems launch revolting attack against Baron Trump. Prepare to be disgusted. The depravity of the Democrats is on full display yet again as they continue to ridicule a child. The first family is finally reunited. Melania and Baron Trump moved into the White House earlier this week. However, Baron was spotted playing with a fidget spinner as he ex uh, exited Air Force went, One, causing liberals to mercilessly mock him and imply that he's mentally handicapped. Cyrus Doberman tweeted, special needs kids need special attention when exposed to the realities of the world. Maybe a fidget spinner would help Barron. Is this graceful? Melania and Barron Trump have moved back into the White House as scheduled now that Barron has finished the school year. Barron arrived in Washington wearing an awesome t-shirt with the expert written on it as he descended the steps of the plane, a fidget spinner can be spotted in his hand. Fidget spinners are the hottest toy craze in America right now, and almost everyone under the age of 16 has at least one of the toys, much to the confusion of adults. Fidget spinners are deceptively simple. They are merely a bull bearing with Handles attached, allowing children to spin them on an axis held between their fingers. Purveyors of the fidget spinners like to herald the therapeutic or stress-relieving benefits of the toy, but it is really just a glorified top. It offers no more therapeutic benefits than squeezing a tennis ball. However, when liberals spotted Baron with the most popular toy in America, they automatically used it as, quote, proof that the 11-year-old boy has mental problems. The reality is that Barron is a normal child, and the left has, a pro uh, has problems. Young children of politicians are supposed to be off-limits, but the left has targeted Barron as hostility against the Trump family continues to rise in liberal circles. Losing the election to President Trump has caused the left to go completely insane. Since President Trump took office, Barron has been ridiculed and called autistic, ugly, a homeschooler, a school shooter, a future psychopath, and a potential murderer. Even Kathy Griffin claimed she would be targeting Barron Trump in December last year. She said attacking the president's 11-year-old son would be her quote edge. The let, let's see how that how well that works out for her. The violent response to President Trump has revealed the true insanity of the left, leaving a sour taste in the mouths of the average American. The Democrats have lost all credibility and are now the party of fear mongers and bullies. Absolutely true. It's disgraceful disgraceful. Let's say the child was special needs. You don't ridicule that. I mean, it's disgraceful. Disgraceful. Let us know what you think in the comments below, and thank you so much for watching.